Hello everyone, this is Stunt Collector here. So I'm back home, um, and I, sorry I've been gone for a little bit. Um, I've been busy with my new job, got a little sunburn from it, but it's all right. But today I went to Target for groceries and I found Major Blood, finally. So let's go over to packaging here for them and then we'll open them up. So you, you get the G.I. Joe Classified Series logo there, Major Blood, Cobra Island Special Mission, and then you get the warning signs here on the corner. So pouring up and then here's the side art here with all the symbols there and you get uh, this the 27th figure and here's Cobra Island here and there's all the warning stuff and then here's a picture of Major Blood there looks pretty cool oh yeah another picture of Major Blood with the helmet and um, other pieces for him now on the top you get the Cobra sign here and number 27 and then here's the bomb with the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here's Major Blood out of the packaging here. So let's go over his accessories first. So first you get two of these little, uh, looks like missiles for him. So yeah, just purely black and you get like the wings there for him. I don't know, maybe it's not, no, it's not missiles. So I think these are supposed to go into this uh, pistol here. Uh, my freaking tripod fell. Um, but yeah, you get this peg here for him. Um, and then you get this like suppressor looking thing, but it has a hole in there. So I don't know if we're supposed to put it in. I don't think so. Yeah, that's not supposed to go in there. So yeah, these are missiles. I thought this would because of the suppressor piece there, but no, but yeah, interesting looking gun. Um, and then you get this backpack piece here for him just black you get the peg there for plugging it into his back like the texturing for it i think this these are supposed to go in there maybe um or maybe not i don't know i guess i'm probably wrong about that um but yeah you get this and you get this other pistol here but it's a revolver so yeah you get that little piece that you have to cock back to shoot i like the pistol a lot here and then the revolver piece here is silver so that's pretty cool i wish they added like a red for the cobra there for him but it looks pretty good uh and then you get this helmet here for him so yeah you get this like uh point here that goes uh, on his forehead and then you get these sharp lines here. It's like soft plastic, so you can bend it a little bit. Um, shoot, I dropped it. Uh, here's the back there for you. And then we'll put it on and put on the accessories after we go over major blood here. But yeah, here he is. So here's his head sculpt here. So yeah, you get this eye patch here. The camera, I want to focus. Focus. Come on, focus. Maybe if I... Focus, come on. All right, it's not one to focus for some reason. Kinda is. All right, well, oh well. Um, let's see if I can zoom in, maybe that'll... Okay, uh, so you get this eye patch here for him, and you get the scar across that eye. You get the mustache for him here. He looks pissed. He is all dirtied up and around the face here. So yeah, you get some around, uh, some like um, I don't know. I think that's supposed to be for his beard, actually. Not sure, or it's probably dirt. Um, but yeah, he looks mad. Uh, you get this cool looking hair here for him. So he's bald around the sides, but then he leaves like a little bit on the top. Uh, you get a little bit of gray hair in there. Um, but yeah, that's the head sculpt. It looks pretty realistic actually. But yeah, and then here's the cool part. So he has this necklace here, which you can take off if you want. Uh, it's dog tags that he collects from, I think his enemies after he takes care of them. Um, but yeah, and then he gets this cool vest here. So yeah, it's a soft plastic too. 
Um, so yeah, this is pretty soft right here around the abs. So I think you should be able to do good on the ab uh, crunch. And then you get this like little uh, piece here. And then you get the belt buckle silver. And then you get this cool pad, eh, shoulder pad here, which I think does a little bit of pivoting. So you can, or maybe not, I'm not sure. But I think it is because it's attached to this and this. Um, but yeah, you get this like M symbol here on the shoulder pad here. It's mm, bicep pads, shoulder, I mean, forearm pads. They're just the hands for them, the gun holding hands. I like the color that they use, silver, or I mean, not, not silver. It's like a matte uh, gray, like a very dark gray. In person, it looks black. Um, on camera, it kind of looks like it has a little green tint. I'm not sure what the deal is with that. Um, but yeah, you get some uh, in the brown sh uh, shirt here. Uh, so yeah, I think this is supposed to be, it kind of looks like a robotic arm. Yeah, it is. Um, so, so yeah, and then you get the brown shirt here, long sleeve, you get a uh, forearm pad. Here's his actual hand here, gun holding hand. So yeah. And then here's the pants here. So you get a holster for his gun. Looks good. Here's the belt buckle. So you get silver buckle here. And then you get these like other attachments here that kind of look like they might be grenades. Brown pants. Um, some like camouflage looking knee pads here. Here's the shin guards here. Silver, it kind of looks like it has scratches on them. Looks cool. And then you get a uh, toe pad there. And here's the back. Here's the back of the figure here and then yeah so let's go over the uh, articulation here for him so his head can hinge up that far hinge down that far uh, he has a neck joint too so you can go up just a little bit higher go down a little bit more uh, his shoulders can move out uh, not quite to 90 degrees pretty close uh, you can do 360 rotation there. He has a um, butterfly joint there, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows. So we can get farther. So yeah, it goes past 90 degrees, so that's good. Uh, wrists can hinge, I think side to side. Yes, yeah, side to side. So he wants to just go down that far and yeah, up that far. Uh, wrist swivel there. He has an ab crunch that goes that far pretty good with the padding that he has here so that's nice backwards quite a bit he also has a ball joint at the waist so he can go down a little bit farther if you want backwards a crap load uh, and then you can also get him to go side to side here 360 rotation around that ball joint there um, he has the drop down hips here so that's nice so you can kick out that far forward a lot backwards Quite a bit. Thigh eye cut. Uh, double jointed knees there. He has a boot cut. Uh, ankles hinge down that far, up that far. Nice ankle pivot. And then also for the accessories, so you get the backpack here. Plug that in just like that. And I just, just saw that as a peg there. Peg hole for this gun here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, so you just want to plug that in right there just like that um and then the revolver goes in there if it fits there we go and then the helmet goes here and that's what it looks like with the helmet on here and then these pieces i'm pretty sure they're supposed to go on the backpack let me see if i can get those on there it kind of clips in so that's nice But yeah, that's what he looks like with the accessories there. But yeah, I recommend getting them because at some point they're just gonna be gone and um, it's gonna be expensive. Uh, right now, they have a lot of them up. So, but I'm pretty sure a lot a lot of people are gonna want to get this. So I recommend trying to get them soon before uh, stores run out. I don't think they will anytime soon. But later on, the these figures can be. Uh, worth a lot so um, but yeah 
recommend getting them. Uh, Articulation is good. I love the detail on this figure. Uh, accessories are good. Um, I don't really have any problems with the figure. I don't see any mist paints or anything like that. Um, but yeah, um, that's all I got for the figure. So make sure you guys check out my Twitch since I'm back home. Uh, I'll be able to stream my games now. Um, I still got to finish up Resident Evil Village. Uh, I got Crew 2 to play. I got uh, Rust and a few other games. So make sure you guys check that out at The Hunter Collector on Twitch. Um, but besides that, that's all I got. Mm -hmm.